esta metodología, sino que también ya nos contaba el presidente de la República en su conferencia. Esperan lluvias muy fuertes para los próximos días. Ok, so good evening, Mr. Arevalo, Mr. Chavi Rivas. Good evening, sir. Hi, good evening. Mr. Rivas, so, uh, so how are you, gentlemen? I couldn't be better. Are you? All right, so let me ask you, is it cold over there at home? <laughs> yes, yeah, <it's> we're cold. <laughs> it's cold, right? <laughs> yeah. Romix mix is great. <laughs> Lime <Yeah>. cold. <laughs> yeah, it's actually better. Like they said over here, you know, a very uh, popular phrase. It's time to coffee or chocolate cup. <laughs> chocolate, you know, for something hot. Yes. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, whiskey, whiskey is not included over here. <laughs> <laughs> well, <laughs> oh, vodka, vodka <laughs> uh, it's up to you, it's up to you. <laughs> all right, all right. Mr. Alex Cornejo, how are you, sir? Yes, sir. Very good. And you? Yeah, good. Nice, nice weather, right? Yeah, it's a nice weather. If, uh, you know, as, as long as it doesn't rain, everything is okay. <laughs> yeah. Well, did you say that uh, on, on night will the rain will be more stronger? Yeah, supposedly. But if if you know if if you if you heard the uh, the weather broadcast. From Moises Urbina, so it's gonna be the <laughs> It's a liar, this man. It's a liar. <laughs> you never know, right? <laughs> yeah, that's what happens over here. But yes, it's a uh, it's a windy and you know somehow rainy night, rainy. a little bit, right? And cold, a little, yeah, bit. or chilly, I would say. Yeah. But so far we are lucky, right? Yeah, so far we've been lucky. Have you seen the memes, the yes, memes, yes. you know, about this? Like the trajectory of, of the uh, storm? <laughs> uh, I don't know, no, I don't see this. You haven't seen the uh, the memes, you know, from, from the store? I'm from the storm, sorry. Uh, no, no, I don't see them. Okay, I'm gonna share one with you. Let's see if I can find <laughs> Okay, great. <laughs> All right, so just one second. Yeah, this one. Hold on. All right, so be, uh, while I'm saving this, I need to ask you. Same yeah. question, you know, same question. Uh, uh, the coordination has been asked, has been asking everyone. Have you completed the platform, by the way, or are you about to finish? <laughs> you know, I need to ask. <laughs> yes. Yeah, we... yeah, that's the attitude, you know. That's the attitude. So let me just one second. One second. All right, so three more dates, and they are gonna be considered free men and women. You know. Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> so this one, that's the one. Can you see that one? Yeah. Right. No, this is first one I said. <laughs> That's nice. Yeah. That was very yeah. nice. Good. Cool. <laughs> Helping us, right? Helping us, you know, yeah. since he's a god. If you're, if you're familiar with the cartoon, <laughs> that's yeah. the way it is. That's the way it is. 
All right, but let's get serious. All right. <laughs> let's, get, <laughs> let's get serious. Okay. Now, let's, oh. at, let's take a look at this. All right, just one sec. Okay, All right, so ladies and gentlemen, the word of the evening is to go through a rough patch. Okay? If you think of, of the situation that happened in the HAPA, if you think of uh, COVID-19 or right now this uh, storm or hurricane, I can easily tell you, or I can actually tell you that we have been going through a rough patch, and I would say a huge it rough patch. Long patch. <laughs> okay, uh -huh. through very mm -hmm. difficult situations recently. So that's oh. the meaning. That's the meaning of, of a rough patch. Sometimes you may have a rough patch with your wife or your husband, so it's a family situation. Maybe it's a financial problem you have or you, uh, one of your chi children is sick or something like that. So you can yeah. say, so uh, we're going through a rough patch, etc. Oh, all right. Okay, so that's, uh, and I heard this in, in uh, sitcoms, you know, serious movies, and I heard this uh, phrase a lot. So if I were you, I would start using or just to write it down. At least you're gonna be able to understand. Okay. Okay. I watched. Uh, I, I the first time I saw this phrase was in the movie uh, Patch Adams with. Uh, okay. Excuse me. Yeah. No, 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 no. Sorry. Yeah, with uh, Robbie Williams. Robbie Williams. Yeah. Yes. So and he said that that he was going through a very rough patch, and because something bad happened, his friend was killed. So I remember based on that movie. Okay. So. And you have this uh, picture that exemplifies or illustrates the, the actual meaning of a road patch. And you have the, it's a period of trouble, difficulty, or hardship. If you think that this tropical uh, storm or this hurricane classifies for a road yeah. patch, <laughs> yeah, you gotta let me know. Or if you think that COVID-19 can be considered a very long <laughs> a rough patch, well, yeah, let's talk about it. <laughs> yeah, right. But let's see the other side of the story in Spanish, this one. Let me just move this a little bit. Okay. okay. So go through a rough patch. Remember that it, since you're using a verb, in this case, is go, go through a, a rough patch. If, uh -huh. if, if that difficult situation you went through, of course, it's in the past. It's over and then got, you got over it. You can say, I went through a rough patch. Or also, yeah. I had a, a, a rough patch, just like that. A rough patch. Okay. So it's experienced difficult time. Pasar un momento difícil. No tener un buen momento o tener una mala racha, people say too. Okay? Okay. So, uh, this person has a lot of problems at the moment. She's going through a road patch. You can say, I, I am under a, a, a road patch or I'm going through a road patch or I had a, a road patch or I'm having a road, a road patch. It's up to but you. But lucky. Okay. Yes. You're, we're being very unlucky on this. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Okay, so let's let's try to move forward on this. Let's see if you remember the next activity for the night. All right. Is this remember yesterday I introduced to you briefly the uh, yeah. comparisons <clears throat> with nouns and also with adjectives, oh, like is. adjectives of equality uh, and how to express oh. the same ideas to say this is too small, this is too uh, dangerous, etc. Okay, yeah. or there, has, there isn't enough space, etc. So right now, what we're going to do is this activity first, okay? So let me send to you the material and I'm going to split you into purse and you're going to be working uh, in purse. So you ask, for example, I'm gonna choose uh, you, Mr. Arevalo, yeah. and Jill. 
Yes, sir. And so if I go with, uh, there are only a few windows, so you got to quickly tell me the equivalent to this. If you say not enough. So how would yeah, you say enough. That? there are only yeah, a few there windows? There are not enough windows in the house. Correct. So you would say there aren't enough yeah. windows at home. Yeah, and that happens. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so there are some broken windows <laughs> now that it's very windy uh, that's uh, I would say a very uh, real situation okay but a real scenario all right uh, actually the information it's in the chat yesterday but I'm going to send it again so no problem here we go yeah no problem okay so one sec come in here and here we go okay so in total, you have uh, 20 flashcards. You may okay. go uh, in, in order from one to 20, or you just can go one, three, six, et cetera. It's up to you. You may skip some, so no problem. Okay? okay. So uh, bear with me just one second. So my plan for the night is, or for the evening, is to finish all these activities that had to do with uh, the uh, this equality adjectives and, and nouns, okay. okay. So just one sec. Okay, so breakout rooms have been open already. Uh, please go ahead and join them. Okay. So Angel is with uh, Chavi Rivas, Hilda with Robert, Miguel with uh, Roberto, German with Karen, Galdames, Alex with Karen. Perdí la, la, la invitación. <laughs> oh. Yeah, sorry. Not a problem. So, uh, so Chavi joined uh, Angel. He's waiting for you, please, sir. So, uh, Mrs. Miss Contreras, could you please join Hilda? If you don't mind, please. And then let's see, German and Karen. Are you having issues with the with your? Yeah, there we go. So, cut him right there. Um, a little bit cold. <laughs> okay, let's see the the cards. Um, okay. Do you have the, the page open, the, the web page? Yes. yes. Okay. okay, number one, there are only a few windows, not enough. There are not uh, enough windows? Okay. Yes. yes, there are not yes. enough windows. There are not enough windows, okay. Next, it's not bright enough. Bright enough. It's um, all right. So, um, German, I'm sorry to I'm sorry, I'm sorry to interrupt you over here. So yes. it's okay. it's up to you. You may go. Uh, so you ask the first one. So cutting uh, gives you the answer, and then she asks, and then you you take okay. turns. I think. Yes. Yes. Okay. All right. Okay. Yeah, and by the way, I'm sharing this screen. So if you wanna go uh -huh. ahead and take a look. <laughs> Ah, uh, okay. I was looking at the web page. Yeah. Okay. Um, um, well, um, if you can change the number. Number two. Let's yes. go with number three. Okay. 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 And in this case, I'm gonna help you out. I, so, Karim in, in German. I mean, I'm okay. gonna ask. So, let's go ahead with you, sir. Uh, it has only one bathroom. So German? There are not oh. enough bathrooms. Okay, you can, yeah, you may say that too, but what's another option yeah. too? German? It, yes? He has not, he uh, has enough bathroom? bathroom? Yes, yeah, something like that, he doesn't have. It doesn't, doesn't have, have it doesn't have enough you know, bathrooms or you can like Karen also uh, said yeah there aren't have. enough bathrooms you may say okay that. it doesn't have okay. right 
If it has a verb just like this, you may say it doesn't have or the house, it, uh, it doesn't uh, have enough space, etc. So if it has a verb like has or something like that, uh, we can use the auxiliary. Yeah, you use does, does. or doesn't, uh, correct. Okay, or okay, you can okay, also okay. say there isn't or there aren't. It's up to you. There aren't enough buttons. Mm -hmm, buttons. Correct. Okay. All right, so let's see, Karim, it's not convenient enough. Um, to, it's, it's not, it's too com inconvenient. It's too, it's too inconvenient, you may say too. too yeah, and you can also give the reason why. So it's too small, it's too dark, or it's too, I don't know, far from my job, etc. Okay. Like, like it's too inconvenient because it's too dark. Because it's too dark. Yeah, it's too dark. yeah correct, yeah. correct. Okay. Or it's too expensive, you know, for me, so I can't oh. afford it. So, okay. you, so you may say that too. Uh, so uh, let's see, German. It's not spacious enough. Story of my life, mm -hmm. right? <laughs> <laughs> well, it's like um, the other word. Uh, I will be the opposite. It's too cramped. 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 Cramped, yeah, you cramped? may say, yeah, you may say oh, it's too say cramped. That? Yeah, cramped. Cramped. Okay. Cramped, yes. Cramped? Or, you, or you would say it is too small, which is... Too small, yes. It's still yeah. <laughs> but cramped gives it a, another meaning. Like, it's besides being small, yeah, you, you don't have enough space. Your, your stuff, I don't know, your furniture, like refrigerator stuff, they don't fit. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Or, or, yes. Or, or, or like they are too... Um, um, Muy juntos, muy pegaditos, ¿cómo se yeah, cramped. Yeah, you say cramped. 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 Oh, okay. That's the that's yeah. one. That's, yeah. I was looking for another word. No, that's the one. Like mm -hmm. in Spanish, okay. we okay. like topados. <laughs> okay. like, like my room. Yeah. <laughs> space remember remember <laughs> yesterday, German, the bed sitting room. <laughs> yes, yes, exactly. Yes, exactly. Okay. I, you know, I got to leave you, uh, everyone. I got to visit some of your oh, Okay, folks. okay, okay. Sure. So try if if you if you don't mind, you can also share the screen. One of you may share the screen, if okay. if that's possible. If you're with the computer, so that'd be great, actually. The the Mexican the apartment is a is has has the house. <laughs> yes, <Yeah. laughs> Okay, so it's, excuse me, uh, what number are you in right now? Sorry, sorry. <laughs> no, not a problem, Hilda. Uh, so what number are you uh, right now working on? The night. Number nine. We'll see. A yes. house has three bathrooms and your house three bathrooms. Is that the one? Yes. Okay. Uh, my whole house has three bathrooms. Uh, your whole has three bathrooms. No, no. Okay, so could you please use as and as a uh, rover? Uh, my whole has as many three, no, many bathrooms has your house. Okay, so my house has as many bathrooms as it has your house. Your house. You, you don't have to actually say the number because what you're saying is it has as many bathrooms as yours. Uh, okay. So that's why you're you're telling uh or you're you're saying so you know that my house has three bathrooms, which is you know uh, a lie. <laughs> it's not true. And yours has three as well. So I'm saying so we're equal. Okay. Okay. So you just say my house has has as many bathrooms as yours, just like that. Okay. Yeah, we don't have to actually, you know, complicate our lives in there. Okay. Thank you. So Hilda, help us on this one. The apartment is private and the house is private. Uh, the, the apartment has as private private and as uh, the house. Yes, that's right. The apartment is as private as the house. Simply just like that. Okay. Nice. Okay, Bobby. The Jones have two children, and the Smiths have five. Uh, 
in this case, you gotta be careful because it's uh, they're not equal. Ah, okay. What, what number is? Number 11, but I'm sharing the screen. Can you see the screen and sharing with you? Uh, okay. the, the... Yes. The young, uh -huh. uh, the young don't have, uh, mm -hmm. has many children, has the Smith. And the Smith, correct. The Jones don't have as many children as the Smiths. Simply just like that. And you can see the answer actually. You see? Yes. <laughs> nice. Uh, yeah, okay. don't don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, don't do it, please. I mean, if you want to just double check it, you can do it. But since it, this is a mental exercise, it would be better if you actually take the challenge and then double check it. But in this okay. case, I'm your double check, you know, your knowledge check. <laughs> Hilda, the house is more spacious than the apartment. The house as spacious as the apartment. No, but in this case, we're, 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 more. Yeah, we're saying that the house is bigger. So the, oh. the so you may start with the last one, you know, the apartment. Ah, uh, the apartment is not, is not big, bigger or, or biggest? Say, no, 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 you don't, you don't, you use just an adjective. You don't say bigger or the biggest. You just put the apartment is not as spacious as uh, this one or big mm -hmm. or, or, or as. The apartment is... It's not? No. It's not? Uh-huh. I'm confused. <laughs> yeah, the thing, is, the thing is that you want to use this structure as a spacious as. The only thing you got to uh, understand is that the house is bigger and it's more spacious than the apartment. So if you want to say, so I know the house is bigger. So how do I say the same thing but using as and as uh, spacious as? The, par so you, the uh -huh. apartment uh -huh. don't as spacious as spacious as the house yes if it's just an adjective Don. and you have is you gotta use okay. is but you know uh the apartment is not or isn't as spacious as spacious as the house mm -hmm. okay and in spanish that would be no, no, es tan, no es tan espacioso como okay uh -huh. so the apartment is not as as spacious as the house okay, okay. but you oh, continue oh. And then you see the answer in here. The apartment is not as spacious as the house. All right? So I'm not lying to you. <laughs> <It's not>. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> nice. So keep on working. I'm going to visit some of your friends over here. Hmm? All right. So continue. There All right, so Angel and Chubby, are you done practicing over here? We practice, yeah. Okay. So I'm going to do a knowledge check with everyone right now. So what I'm gonna do is, let's wait, you know, to start with, let's, let's, let's wait a, a second in here. All right. <clears throat> All right, so for those of you who discovered that this uh, page had a, uh, the answers included, <laughs> lucky, lucky you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, that, that's, that's great. Now you see there, magic. So the apartment is not as suspicious as the house, but that's not the exercise. So I'm gonna go with 13 on, and I'll be choosing seven participants so one 
and you're going to help me with this. So the apartment is more convenient. The house is less convenient. Okay, so I would say this is a little bit more complicated, but you're going to help me figure this out. Uh, all right. Remember that since you have access to this, you may be looking at the answer, you know, right now. There's no way I'm going to find out if you were not looking or, or not. <laughs> if you were looking or not. So let's see, Bobby Celaya, help us on this, sir. Yes. yes. Uh, mm -hmm. The the house is not has convenient has the, the apartment. Correct. The house is not as convenient as the apartment. And let's see what the answer. Yes, correct. The house is not as convenient as the apartment. Why? Because the apartment is more convenient. That's obvious. <laughs> okay. Yes. And there are you may at least start to list many reasons because it's it's cheap or um it has more services etc you know the uh the uh bread seller el vendedor de pan you know <laughs> just around the corner so thank you sir yes the apartment rents i'm gonna choose somebody else the apartment rents for six hundred dollars a month the the house rents for one thousand a month okay so we have the apartment which costs monthly 600 and then the house rent is a thousand dollars and you will yeah. see it as expensive as to start with you have to identify that in here one is more expensive than the other one so you have to use a negative thing if you wanna if you wanna use as expensive as as okay so let me just go ahead and choose a lady if you don't mind cutting help us on this one please uh so yep. yeah thank you the apartment is not as expensive as the house okay you got it appreciate that let's move with miguel franco the next one sir but let me skip you know that until 16. there are in bedrooms okay this is actually pretty simple. So, Mr. Franco, help us on this one. All right, so let's try to do this together then. So, there are in bedrooms, and did you just put enough? What would be the, the uh, correct way to say this? So, everyone, this will be general, it applies to everyone. So, there are in bedrooms. Uh -huh. There aren't just enough bedrooms. Yes, you can say there aren't just enough bedrooms at home. Next one, it's not private. Not private enough. It's not private enough, yes. The last one, there aren't parking spaces. And there you go with? There aren't enough. There aren't enough parking spaces. There aren't enough parking space. Yes. And the neighborhood uh, doesn't have street lights. The, the neighborhood doesn't have enough, enough yeah you, you may, yeah but in this case i would say it's a little bit contradictory because it doesn't have any so but you may say it doesn't have enough it's okay but if there aren't anything so it's yeah. better if you say that next one the living room is in spacious okay The living room isn't enough spacious. The living room isn't spacious enough. All right. Spacious enough. Or, or you may say the living room is not spacious enough. So it doesn't really matter. Okay. okay. Nice. Let's move forward in here. I want you to practice this, but in a conversation. Unfortunately, the conversation that I have ready for you tonight does not have the grammar within the conversation itself but okay. it has to do with you know when you rent a house or an apartment that context is the united states because over there it's a little bit more i would say complex and the apartments or house houses are a little bit more expensive as well okay yeah let me just move forward so general listening quiz apartments for rent so what i'm gonna do for you 
is just to play the listening and which you're going to tell me something that you were able to understand or you're able to understand out of the listening. Yeah. So, so tonight we're, I'm not gonna share with you the access to the conversation first. So instead of doing that, we're gonna go step by step. The first one is, just listen to it, get details down and get main ideas written down, okay? Okay. So just keep in mind that the context is apartments for rent. And uh, this has another degree of difficulty, which is the conversation happens in a phone call, all right? So if it's a phone call, it would be a little bit more difficult to understand for some of you, but uh, mm -hmm. I think you're going to handle this just fine, okay? So it's a challenge, by the way, not like the ones in TikTok <laughs> or, or, <laughs> or Facebook, but it's a challenge, you know? Yeah. Okay, so uh, let me just one second here. Yeah. There we go. So, <clears throat> so uh, right now you have the time to write things down or if you have a good memory. Uh, so do not really trust your memory because we, we what I want you to get is details. All right. And all, besides okay. the main idea of this. So I'm getting this uh, just for, for me to play it. So it's just going to take just one moment. There Sorry, teacher, what are we going to do? Because I, I lost the internet connection. For a yeah, minute. there was there was like a blackout over here yes, too. Exactly. Yes, yes, <laughs> yes. So don't worry, I'm going to play the listening. Just pay attention okay. and write the main idea. Of course, it has to do with someone calling for, the, for an apartment uh, because she's looking for places and then any uh, details in there, okay? Yes, sir. So, so just one second. I have it here. There we go. Okay. We can hear. I can hear. You cannot hear anything? No. Anything. No, anything. Or the hell phones, maybe. No, I know what the problem is. It's that I didn't choose share computer sound. <laughs> uh, okay. okay. <laughs> yeah. You know, I, I changed my the settings of my computer because last time that was the issue, but you know, this time I forgot. <laughs> okay. I chose this, but here we go. Hold on. Hello. Hello, oh, yes. Roger. This is Anne. Yeah. Oh, hi, Anne. How have you been? And how's your new apartment working out? Well, that's what I'm calling about. You see, I've decided to look for a new place. Oh, what's the problem with your place now? I thought you liked the apartment. Oh, I do, but it's a little far from campus and the commute is just killing me. Do you think you could help? I thought you might know more about the housing situation at the school. Okay, what's your budget like? I mean, how much do you want to spend on rent? Uh, somewhere under $200 a month, including utilities, if I could. Oh, and I prefer to rent a furnished apartment. Hmm, and anything else? Yeah, I need a parking space. Well, I know there's an apartment complex around the corner that seems to have a few vacancies. I'll drop by there on my way to class today. Hey, thanks a lot. No problem. All right, that's pretty much it. What do you think? Do you think that, it, that he's being ironic when he asks anything else? Because the girl wants everything for a very low price. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> not, it's like, not okay. Even here, <laughs> not even here. Right? Like that, yeah. You furnish <laughs> apartment, a parking space. <laughs> not too far from campus. $200. Great. <laughs> Something impossible. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> it's mission impossible, you know. Yeah. <laughs> That's like the movies I... over there. <laughs> okay. Nice. Um I, I based on your comments, I, I can see that you were able to catch most of the details. Yeah. So what what's the budget you said again? Two thousand dollars. Two thousand, no, that's too much. Two hundred. Yeah. yeah, she's now uh, Congresswoman, you know. 
una diputada y una de aquí de este nombre, <laughs> who can pay $2,000. <laughs> oh, that, that, that's the kind of, 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 of audience that they pay in places like San Francisco, New York, Los Angeles. Too. Yes, $1,000. Uh, in I Los Angeles. Really, really expensive. Really, exp really expensive. <laughs> in Los really Angeles, I have, I have an aunt. She doesn't live in, uh, there anymore. But uh, she used to pay a thousand five hundred dollars for yes. a let's see yes. one bed one bedroom apartment yeah. with with the living room and just the kitchen. It, it was like a peninsula, like we call it, yes. and the bathroom over there. Yes. So, so really expensive. Yeah, yes. her children were were small at that time, but then she had to move to move out. All right. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. And imagine a thousand five hundred dollars, not even our salaries. <laughs> wow. Yo, here. Yes. Uh, exactly. hi. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay. Now so let's get. Know. Yes. I'm going to uh, show you right now. Now let's do something here because I think this should be very personal. It's up to you if you wanna. I don't know if you if you wanna take the quiz or not. Uh, but I think it's better if you have access by yourself, listen mm -hmm. to the to the uh, conversation again, and and then test your comprehension. And then, as 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 we always do it, send the uh, the score through the chat if you want. Okay, okay right. Correct. So, but in in this opportunity, I know how you you know how this you, up to this point you might know how the system works, yeah. but. Uh, Let's try to complete the quiz without reading the script. Because trust me, my, my friends, that's going to help you increase your vocabulary and your comprehension. Yeah. Yes. Ooh. There you go. I sent information in the personal chat. I, I, I just heard, you know, that beep. <laughs> and uh, I'm sending this as we speak in the uh, Zoom chat. So. Why don't you mute your microphones, plug in your earpucks, okay? And listen to the conversation, take the quiz over there. Let me share the screen with you. Give me just 30 seconds, so don't start yet because I don't want to interrupt you, okay? So just one second, let me just get the right screen because I really want to share this with you. So one second. There we go. Right. Um, yeah, much better. So do you see the screen I'm sharing with you? Can somebody uh, double check it? Yes. All right, so first question is, what's the main topic of the conversation? I'm not gonna uh, read the actions, but that's the first question. Number two, why does Anne like her current apartment? Number three, how much money does Anne want to pay for rent? You know this already. Uh, Anne wants to rent an apartment that <laughs> pretty much has it all. <laughs> <laughs> and then to help Anne, Roger is going to, et cetera. And that's it. Okay. Yeah. So that's it. So get to work, please. Okay. And, sir. Share this, and share the score with me, please. Thanks.
Okay, so I just got the UNICE uh, score. So let's see Karen, and let's see how much, five out of five. Nicely done. All right. Let's see, anybody else? Mr. Bobby Celaya, five out of five as well. Nice. Way to go, sir. Way to go. German, German, most of five out of five. Yeah, that's great. Awesome, awesome. One more. Okay, one more. And, we, and then we move forward. All right, so right now I'm going to uh, give you some spoilers out of this uh, conversation. <laughs> let's try to uh, let's try to get the responses as a class all together. Good job, Alex, and thanks for the ones who sent uh, their uh, scores already. If you are not able to send it right now, you can do it later. So there's no problem at all. But let's let's try to uh, go over the questions in here. So I'm gonna ask. And please tell me the response. Okay. okay. Thank you. So, what's the main topic of the conversation? A search for a new apartment. Search for a new apartment. Let's choose this one. Okay. So, why does Anne like her current apartment? Okay, so I'm asking everybody over here. So far, if anybody can actually help me. For the campus. It's far from campus. Okay, it's far from campus. It's far from campus. So, all right. So one second, uh, next one. How much money does Anne want to pay for rent? No more, no than, more than 200. 200. Yeah. No more than 200. If it's possible, nothing. <laughs> if it, if, yeah, you're right. <laughs> yeah, she wants to get a grant, you know, or, or a scholarship, yeah. a sponsorship. <laughs> yeah, papi paga, you know. Papi paga. Yeah. And wants or sugar daddy, you know, these days you don't know. <laughs> <laughs> this and wants to rent an apartment that everybody has for me. Yes. She wants the whole package over there. Yeah. <laughs> To help Anne, Roger is going to check out an Chicago apartment. apartment. Check out an apartment. Check out an apartment. Okay. Chicago. All right. And according to this, all of the responses are correct. So I, I, I do trust you, everyone. <laughs> Let's yeah. stop sharing this screen. I'm going to send to you the second part of this activity, which is the actual conversation. But I guess some of you already found it. If you haven't, there's nothing to be worried about. There you go. That's the script. Did you get it? Yeah, I got it. Okay, nice. Thank you, sir. So okay. I'm also I'm also going to send this to the uh, Zoom chat, and I'm going to split you into pairs. And this time you're gonna practice. One is going to be what's the name of the girl, by the way? It's Andra. Yes, I'm ready. yes, okay. So, and then the other one is Roger. So, Rogers and Hans are also working in here. Alex, Karen, German, Robert, mm -hmm. Alas, Angel, Xavi, Ilda, Bobby, Celaya, eh, Karen with Miguel Franco. So, try to join this. Let's practice, let's say, two to three minutes. Switch the roles. Okay, Anne and Roger, and then Roger and Anne. Oh hi Anne. How, how how I'm sorry, how have you been? And how's your new apartment working out? Oh well, that's what I'm calling about. Uh you see, I decided to look for a new place. Oh, what's the problem with your place now? I thought you liked the apartment. Um I do, but it's a little far from campus 
and the commute is just killing me. Do you think you could help? I thought you might know more about the housing situation near, near the school. Okay, what's your budget like? I mean, how um, much do you want to spend on rent? Um, somewhere under 200 a month, including utilities, uh, so if I could. Oh, and I prefer to rent a furnished apartment. Mm, anything else? <laughs> yeah, I need a parking space. Mm. <laughs> well, yeah. <laughs> the woman can actually pay for you, so. <laughs> yeah. Well, I know there is a apartment complex around the corner that seems to have a few vacancies. I will drop by there on my way to class today. Hey, thanks a lot. No problem. <laughs> I need okay. to serve and too. <laughs> <laughs> and then a maid, you know, a maid. Maid. M-A-I-D. Maid. Maid. Okay. Yes. Okay, so vacancies in here, uh, Alex. Vacancies. Yes. Vacancies. vacancies. Sorry. Yes. All right. Not a, no, try to switch. Now, uh, Alex, you're going to be in. Okay. And then, um, okay, Roger. And then Roger will be Karen. Okay. Okay, hello. Hello, Roger. This is Anne. Oh, hi, Anne. Oh, how have you been? And how is your new apartment working out? Well, well that's, uh, that's what I'm calling about. You see, I decided to look uh, for a new place. Oh, what's the problem with your, with your place now? I told you like the apartment. Oh, I do, but it's a little far from campus and the community, and just killing me. And do you think you could help me? I thought I thought I thought that you might uh, know more about the housing situation near to school. Okay, what's your budget like? I mean, how much do you want to spend on rent? Parking space. Well, I know there is and the permanent complaints around the corner that since they have to have a few vacancies all dropped by their on my way to, to class today hey thanks a lot no problem All right, so right now I need a, a, I mean, two volunteers. I need Mr. Roger and I need Anne, okay? Okay, I will be Mr. Roger, okay? You will be Roger, Angel, nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're gonna be the helping hand, una mano amiga. <laughs> <laughs> Another gonna, volunteer? Okay, so it could be a girl or a boy, it doesn't really matter. All right. So Alex, you're gonna be in, no problem. Okay. Okay, great. Let me go ahead and share the screen with you. Okay. So you can actually look at this screen. But let me just, one moment. I wanna go okay. on the screen if possible. Or just to, no, I don't think I'm not able to. Uh, but can, can you actually read from here? Yes or not? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, okay, I got the part of it in, in my cell phone. Nice. So, Roger, go ahead, please. Okay. Hello. Hello, Roger. This is Anne. Oh, hi, Anne. How are you been? And how on the new apartment working out? Well, that's what I'm calling you, calling about. You see, I have decided to look for a new place. Oh, what's the problem with the play you replace? I thought that you like the apartment. Oh, I do, but it's a little far from campus. And the commute is just killing me. Do you think you could help? I thought you might know more about the housing situation near the, the school. Okay, what's your budget like? I mean, how much do you want to spend on rent? 
who somewhere under 200 a month, including <laughs> utility, if he, if they could. Oh, and I prefer a rent a uh, furniture, furniture apartment. Mm, um, anything else? Yeah, I need a parking space. In your car. <laughs> Right. <laughs> yeah. oh, right. Right. Well, I know there is a permanent uh, complex around the corner and they seem to have a few vacancies. I'll drop by, by the by the, on my way to class today. Hey, thanks a lot. No problem. Yeah, okay. buy a bicycle, you know, it's actually from, better. From <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I, if you remember... <laughs> If you may be wondering what utilities mean, actually, you got this from context, it's the bills. Yeah. So, hey, what, yes, sir. You see the, the commute a little. Yeah, yeah, commute is to travel from one place to another one. If you live in Suyapango and if you take the bus, so you it's, commute from work to right. from uh, home, from home to work. Talking about, the ti talking about the time or the, or the, um, is the actual uh, is the action actually the action oh, okay yes okay. Uh, o sea, right. viajar uh, from one place to another one to travel to me all right yes but if you're thinking of, of the actual translation to this because sometimes that helps yeah. uh, that means viajar diariamente al trabajo to travel to work okay that's commute travel is just in general all right, but in this case, if you commute, it's because you have to work. All right. Like in my case, the school is in Santa Tecla, so I commute every single day. So I work from home now, so I no longer have to commute. Okay. Okay. But thanks for asking. Okay. Um, let's see. Where's the picture? Here it is. Yeah, vacancies it means that it's actually open. Like when you go to a hotel, I won't say motel because that's a different story. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, be careful with that. Be careful. You have to wait sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you get that's that's a vacancy. And also vacancy also applies if you want to apply for a job. If there are yeah. some uh, openings, it means that there are some vacancies. vacancies. Same situation in there. All right. And okay. working out, you know, working out, it, it doesn't really mean, uh, you know, to exercise. It work out means, you know, if actually things are going well, okay, working yeah. out. But work out means also to exercise. You know, do, do you work out every day? You can say yes or not. Okay. 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 Nice. So next activity, because we still have a couple of minutes. Yeah. Right. All right, un poco explotador, verdad? Pero that's the attitude. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's the attitude. Okay, so let me just pull up the uh, presentation me here, and let's see what's next. What's coming uh, up next is not as interesting as you may think, but it's some practice. You don't have to write anything down, but uh, I'm gonna send you, let's say, in groups of three, and this time you're gonna be taking terms studying this this grammar you're gonna complete two exercises two grammar exercises. okay okay so uh let me just share the screen with you very quickly because we're running out of time um that's the one so complete the sentences using as space and then as and you have exercise 107.1 it's not a radio station just to be clear <laughs> and then i'm told Number two, my salary is high, but yours is higher. My salary isn't. You know how it's it works. Okay. As yours. Correct. So that's why I'm going to be sending this to you, this exercise. And then I'll be sending this one as well. Write a new sentence with the same meaning. You don't have to write anything down. Instead of writing, you're going to speak. Okay. Sorry about that. And uh, if time elapses it, you're gonna be also practicing with these images. I'll be sending the access to this. It, it, it's some uh, monuments or places that you can visit here in El Salvador. You gotta be careful, of course. And yes. what I want you to do is to compare, for example, the Santa Ana Cathedral with uh, the uh, cathedral here in San Salvador. You may say both yes. are as beautiful 
uh, you know, or Santa Ana's Cathedral is as beautiful as, or San Michael City, you're right. Or National Palace is as beautiful as the uh, former CIFCO, you may say. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so that's why you have to complete exercise 107.1, 107.2, and then try to uh, look at these images, which I'll be sending to you to practice the uh, this type of grammar. Copy that? Okay. okay, sir. So the topic is top destination singles are boards. You have to scroll down the image over there. But first of all, let's deal with the first two images. So I'm going to split you, but before I need to send this to the personal chat, the, the two exercises, okay? So just one second here. And nice. Yes, so both uh, images have been sent to you, okay? Yeah. And then let me send the access to the uh, monuments, you know, to the top destinations in El Salvador. By the way, don't get surprised, but apparently, you know, that website chose an image from San Salvador having access, I don't know, to a bay or to a river, or to the ocean. So that's a wrong image. <laughs> yeah, you're gonna, you're gonna realize that when you see it. Okay, so the third thing, the third thing would be... Um, and we have to write the answer or no, this? No, every team is speaking. Every team is speaking, all right? Okay. You may write it down just to practice the grammar uh, over the weekend, but right now, just try to practice. You only have two minutes, by the way. <laughs> Go ahead, please. Um, two minutes. Yeah, two minutes. I mean, we may continue tomorrow, but at least you get familiar tonight, okay? So one second here. I have an error. You got the, an error on the last one? Yeah, yeah, because the, the machine don't, don't charge. It doesn't open anything. Okay, but let me send it again, but I'll be sending this to the to the uh, personal chat. But let's practice with the first two images. So join the break rooms, please, for the okay. grammar. Okay, let me fix the uh, the you know, the axis for the last 10. Okay, just one second here. Something no, say, say, you don't know too much uh, about cars as uh, well. I don't know because they say you don't know, you know a bit about cars, but I know more. Say it, uh, and the answer, the answer will be you don't know more. Now, in this case, uh, I, uh, Angel, you have to use yeah. just. As, 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 as much as, as as much as just like that. Much. So you would say yeah. you don't know much. about cars, about much. cars, 
you may say you don't know about cards as much. I know, right? As I know. Ah, uh, you don't know as about us. Mm. See, it's a little confusing with this. <laughs> you don't know. Uh, you don't know uh, as much as cars uh, uh, as 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 me or as I know. As you may say. Oh, but but it's easier if you say you don't know about courts as much as I know or as much as, as much as I oh, do. Okay, okay. Oh, okay. But you know, time is up actually, and I'm sorry I'm going to catch you in here. But tomorrow we're gonna the first activity will be this. Okay. 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 These and okay. the top destinations. So Alex, can you double check yeah. if if the link I sent the last one, the access, it actually works? And let me see. Ooh, it's a. It, it's very long. That's why I didn't want to yeah, send this to you. Uh, the, it's still, it's still wrong. Yeah, we're wrong. Okay, so uh, I, I, I have to I have to fix it then. Don't worry about yeah. that. Okay, so let's mm -hmm. you know let's actually go back because my okay, other okay. students are waiting for me. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Sure. Okay, let's see you tomorrow. Yeah, see, see you tomorrow. Yeah, see you tomorrow, right. 8 o'clock. Yeah, hopefully. Have, have a great night, sir. Good night, you too. See you tomorrow. Okay, bye. Yeah, see you tomorrow, everyone. I have a class, so I'm sorry to uh, be uh, <laughs> rushing me here. It's okay, don't worry. Yeah, have a, have a great night. Hope to see you tomorrow, Thursday. And okay. remember, tomorrow we have a class, same as Friday. Okay. 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 Bye. Yes. okay. Bye. Bye. Bye.